So, Thank you. Okay. Now this next one is really big. Yeah. I am a sweater. Yes. My friend Janet is a sweater. My husband is a sweater. When we go to the gym, we are the people that no one will get on machines on either side of us because we are like so they have gross. Those pads that the right. wipe it off after you use it. Yes, That's for no, you. we always do that. Okay. But like we're those people that gross other people out because we sweat so yes. much. So Allison is one of our viewers who's a big sweater like I am. Allison, hi. hi. How are you? Good. So Allison, you're a big sweater too. Yeah. yeah. Yep, been going on for years. It's um, so annoying, right? It doesn't yeah, even have to be that Yeah, it's embarrassing. It's yep. embarrassing. You know, yep. at work, you lift your arm and you've got the sweat stains and, you know, people may think you're nervous, but you're not. It's just material comes in contact with your arms and you start to sweat. And you've tried, I mean, I've tried Everything. every prescription strength out there. Yeah, prescription strength. I mean, I, I even got this undergarment, like, bra thing that's on, almost like a maxi pad for your armpits. <laughs> The dress shields. Yes, dress shields. Yes. Yeah, from America. back in the day when my mom was yeah. a girl, they had dress shields to, yeah. to, to put in your sweaters and things. Yeah. So, I mean, this is a really common problem, exactly. right? Exactly. So this is a game changer. But as you said, excessive sweating is a problem that a lot of people have. I mean, studies show one in five Americans have problems with excessive underarm sweat. And what we think about that, we think about not, oh, hey, I work out and I get a little sweating, but it's those people who, they're at work, it's cool, yet their armpits are still wet. Right. And you ruin <laughs> dresses, you ruin blouses, you, you ruin shirts. And it's embarrassing. Like, you oh, just don't is. like the look of it. Yeah, yeah, and then there's smell associated with it and all that, too. Now, up until now, the things that we've had to treat it have not been the best. And so only about 5% of people will actually go to see a doctor for excessive sweating because what can you do? Well, we have antiperspirants, and sometimes they really don't work. A lot of people did Botox for their Botox cancer. works. It's but a effective. lot of people don't want to put Botox in their body. Not well, everybody sold on Botox. And it's expensive. It's about $1,000 right. <clears> of <throat> treatment, and it only oh lasts God. six months. $1,000? So, so you're looking for, about $2,000 a year. Both pits or just one? Uh, for both. That's, that's, for, <laughs> that's for two pits. So, but that's $2,000 a, a year. And the other thing you can do is surgery. Neurosurgeons will actually go into your neck. They'll cut a nerve that goes to your armpit to stop you from sweating. No, but, thank you. I mean, who wants to do that? No, no one. So this is a mirror dry, okay? And this is a game changer. And it is the newest, the only FDA-approved, long-lasting solution for underarm sweating and no surgery involved. And actually, our volunteer here had it done yesterday. So... Oh my God, please tell me you did something that made you sweaty today and you're not sweating. I came on the show. How nerve-wracking is that? <laughs> no, no sweat. I, actually, when I left the office, running around, you know, I got an 18-month-old doing errands and nothing. I can wear a silk little candy. <laughs> I am so excited. Yeah. So now we have some video of this done. Did it hurt? This done. Did it can... hurt? No. Oh my I God, really I'm didn't. so excited for you. Yeah. How long does it take? So she had this it done. You can see the little injections of an anesthetic. So this is a real potent device that really destroys the sweat glands using microwave energy. Is that, you're a doctor, is that safe for your body? Like, do we have enough sweat glands that you're still going to be okay? Yes, and this has been tested on over 7,000 people over five years. And it is FDA approved. It is FDA approved. So this is something that is a game changer. It's new. A lot of people haven't heard of it. A lot of people, they just think that there's no real solution to sweating. So you get some shots. Do the shots hurt? Not really. Just no, a little push. It was, it was actually more of a surprise so that yeah. it came. So the, the tiniest little needle and then the electromagnetic energy. Basically, it's microwaves. And we've all used microwaves You're before. microwaving your armpit. You are microwaving your armpit in a very controlled fashion. The skin is left undisturbed. It's two treatments, okay, spaced three months apart, an average of 82% reduction in the sweating of your armpit afterwards. So after the first one, though, she's already seeing... A, a that marked difference. day, most patients <clears throat> will see a marked difference even that day. And obviously okay. now she's just a day so off. So you go twice. About how much does that cost? It's about $2,500 to $3,000 for, for the two treatments. For the two treatments. And the, how long does it last? The studies now are, are out two years, and they're seeing the same amount of sweat reduction in two years as they had at six months. So and you're pretty much probably done for life. When these sweat glands are destroyed, they don't come back. Now, the company won't say that it's permanent because the FDA hasn't allowed that yet, but in my opinion, is it permanent? Yes. It's about as close as we can get I'm to I'm real in this sucker home. <laughs> <laughs> it's a game changer. It really is. I'm so excited for you. I, I don't even know what to say. I'm very excited. Congratulations. Thank you. And think of all the money you'll save on deodorant. <laughs> okay. So, our last